What's up, people? How are you? You know I'm in a bad mood, right? You know that I really am hanging on by a thread to sanity, reality. I'm starting to believe that this isn't even real. I'm starting to believe that this surrealistic nightmare that I live in, it can't possibly be real because it can't possibly be this bad for one individual. Now, if you watched yesterday's show, you saw the rant about Zolt. That was nothing. My wife's been bugging me about getting rid of some of my kids' toys down in the basement that we don't need and nobody wants. Oh, I got rid of them yesterday. I smashed them into hundreds of thousands of little pieces scattered all around my basement. Yeah. And that still wasn't anything. Right now, there's only thing, one thing I can do. Put on some good tunes. Just let it go. Because what can I do now? I can just watch the market gap up again in horror. What, what am I going to do? Now, if you're unaware, this program is all about a guy who comes on who has absolutely no idea what he's doing as far as trading the market. That's me. That's what Suck My Nasdaq is all about. What used to be fun was when I would make money, I would buy Option Express, Oxpiss, my dumpy's favorite stock right now. I'd buy it at 2470. I'd sell it at 2570, being happy with my point. I would tell you guys to buy it because everything I sell continues to go up, always, always. And then you would profit from me. So I would make money, you would make money. But now, now I'm losing money and things are a little bit different in my life. And I'm really, really not happy about it. I'm still short the cues and I've been called irresponsible by saying how the market will never go down. But have I been right? Has the market gone down since I've been short the cues? No. And I will continue to say the market will never, ever, ever go down. Maybe 2008 when the Democrats take over, maybe, something like that. Apparently we're ignoring everything that's negative in the world and that is a good time to buy. If we can somehow just shake off every negative thing on the planet that's going on and the market continues to rise, why get in its way? Why? Just moron that I am, I gotta be the one. I gotta be the one. But now I understand why I'm here. I am here for the goodness of humanity. I am here, my purpose. If I was able to heal people, maybe I would go around the world healing people. But what I can do is I can come out here and talk to you people, tell you what to buy so you can make money so that you can heal yourselves. I'm a helper. I'm a healer. I'm here for you. That's all I can do right now. What can I possi What else possibly can I do? It's Father's Day this weekend, and if you see those Kramer commercials about what are you getting your ski daddy for uh, Father's Day? Not for nothing, I don't buy my Coke dealer anything for Father's Day. I don't know him anymore. It's been like 10 or 12 years since I uh, partook in that. But ski daddy? Do you, do you people know that's a drug reference? And I get yelled at for having drug references on this show? He, he does that every single day, ski daddy and booyah. Do a little bit of research what Ski Daddy and Booyah pertain to. I don't know why he embraced those, but, or maybe I do know. And he's a closet cokehead. I'm not saying that, but who knows? You'd be, you have to be on a little cocaine to buy stocks when they go up every single day. It's kind of hard to embrace that, right? Normal markets go up and you have a little some pullbacks that last more than 45 minutes. So the bottom line is, I don't know what to tell you anymore. I'm almost being forced to redo my entire portfolio and start buying stocks again. Do I want to do that? I don't think so. So, happy Father's Day. Enjoy your day. And uh, all I can say is keep buying because I guess we're never going down. So, enjoy the weekend. And thank you, Andy Lester and Thunder Preacher. And Bad Dumpy, I know you're loving that Option Express. It gaps up 50 cents every morning for you. Fantastic stock. What else do we got? I don't know. I don't get to, I haven't been getting to all the emails because I'm trying to make a movie right now. You make a movie? Yeah. Good father, go home and play with your kids. Where's that from? Anyway. Oh, that was the first anyway of the show and I'll leave on that. I will be back later if I have some time. If not, enjoy this weekend, fathers, mothers, children, everyone. And please, please, for the love of God, send me some emails and tell me about the money that I've made you this week. Because this is normally a week where I just rake it in. 
and I did nothing but lose. This is just pathetic. So, good day, and see you soon.